All right, what's going on, guys? It's Raven today, bringing you guys an absolute beast gameplay. Go 98 and 10 in 6v6. Uh, I think it was hard point. Yeah, solar hard point. I really like this map. Was using this ASM one, and I put advanced rifling, extended mags, and stock on it. I've been putting stock on some machine guns recently, and I've really been liking it just because of like you could just strafe around and it's harder for enemies to hit you and also stock helps your aim because you can aim with your left uh, thumbstick as well as your right so I took off foregrip for that because I think it's a good payout and it's obviously you know you can see in this gameplay that it worked out pretty well for me and yeah so you guys have probably seen the title I'm not sure what I'm going to title this yet but it's probably going to be what if Black Ops 3 is a bad Call of Duty or something around the lines of that? So, let me just say that I don't think Black Ops 3 will be a bad Call of Duty. Treyarch has personally been my favorite Call of Duty cre <laughs> creator. Sorry about that. Um, World at War, I know a bunch of people loved it. There's a bunch of nostalgia at that. Black Ops 1, outstanding Call of Duty. Black Ops 2, by far my favorite Call of Duty, hands down. Everything about Treyarch zombies is outstanding and that's another good thing about Treyarch so obviously in advanced warfare I'm mainly a multiplayer pub stomper well actually I don't know if I could call myself a pub stomper I'm not that good at the game like I'm decent but I can't get a triple DNA or anything like that so I don't think I would call myself a pub stomper but I do like to go into multiplayer and get gameplays for you guys to watch and stuff like that however you guys do not understand how much black ops 2 zombies black ops 1 zombies World at war i played <laughs> like black ops 2 the reason why it's my favorite call of duty is because like first of all the multiplayer was outstanding like i'm just gonna name off a couple of topics about why it was so good they had so many small three lane maps and the flow of the game was great um the weapons like you didn't have to use two certain weapons like you do in advanced warfare to do good which is you know the battle 27 and as one if you wanna use those two guns you're trying to do good and stuff like that like I am in this gameplay and also like like I said they had so many good things so let's say you're burnt out on playing multiplayer so you get your bros and you're like, hey, let's go play zombies. And like all of their maps were so good. Transit, ugh, I wasn't a big fan of Transit. <laughs> I don't think many people were. Die Rise was actually, I know that not many people liked it and it wasn't my favorite. However, I think it was still a pretty good Call of Duty. Like there were still some fun things that you could do on that map. Um, honestly, Buried in Origins. Those had to be, ooh, I don't know. I like Mob of the Dead as well. Yeah, so those three maps, they were outstanding. And honestly, I'd probably say that Origins was the fan favorite out of all of them. But, you know, there were just so many good options. As you can see, I'm having a hard time telling you guys which one was my favorite. So as you can see, there's a bunch of good options that you could, you know, do and play with your bros and stuff like that if you got bored. And that's just awesome. That's how you know you have a good Call of Duty when you could do that. And, you know, obviously, like I said, World at War, Black Ops 1, and Black Ops 2 have been outstanding Call of Duties. So chances are, why would they mess up on the fourth try, you know? So I think they really got this next Call of Duty, Black Ops 3, down to point. And I think they're going to do a great job with it. However, you know, what's going to happen if Black Ops 3 does suck? Now... If I don't like the multiplayer, like, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you guys this right now, straight up. I am going to be playing a lot of zombies on my channel, picking up that nice feed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got some nice feeds in this game, by the way, so go ahead and watch the kill feed. Just enjoy that if you're not enjoying anything else. But I'm not sure, like, if I would go to a pure zombies channel if multiplayer sucked. I'm not sure, I don't know, if the campaign was amazing, like Black Ops 2's campaign, I loved it, like just the freedom that they gave you 
for the first time in you know campaign that was pretty awesome and also i like how you could like i said you could get your bros you could be like hey let's go grind out this campaign and beat it you know because you could do that just like you could in world at war which is i I think that's an outstanding idea. There's so many things that they haven't done for a while, including a beta. We haven't had a Call of Duty beta since World at War. We haven't had co-op campaign since World at War. And then all of the great things are going to be coming back. Okay, so from what we've seen, the maps are three lane. The hit detection is really good. It seems like you could use every weapon in the game and do good. Um, like the weapon balancing, it's just really good from what we can see so far. Picking up another feed in this gameplay, I'm telling you guys, watch the feed. <laughs> you know, just watch the feed. <laughs> but, I don't know, would you guys like to see me go to an all zombies channel? Because, okay, I'm not sure if you guys know this or not. However, the zombies community is so nice. It really is. All the viewers are so nice not gonna lie pub stomping <laughs> okay the pub stomping side of things I'm just gonna say it. the viewers are typically mean they're aids and they're not good okay you'll say like oh your gameplay sucks you got a triple DNA and uplink you're bad you know stuff like that you know you hear a bunch of people complaining about reverse boosting when it's the same thing in every Call of Duty, you find noobs and you get gameplays off them. You know, there's just so many hateful people in the pub stomping scene that I honestly don't want to be in it. Obviously, if I get in Carnage Clan, I would love to be in it, and that would be awesome for me. However, you know, other than that, I really wouldn't want to be in the pub stomping scene. Just because of, I'm not saying all the viewers are mean. And hateful and stuff like that it's just that there's a lot more people that are like that and they're more picky about gameplays and stuff like that but zombies okay so let me take one example of how nice the zombie viewers are okay so let's take the smith place he's a pretty big uh zombies uh youtuber he's got about 450,000 subscribers right now he played with mr t lexify when he had 15,000 subscribers okay Mr. T Lexify had 15,000 subscribers. After one video, he, I think he gained over 200,000 subscribers after one video. <laughs> okay, I'm not even joking. That's how nice they are. Everybody's friendly, stuff like that. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Obviously, we could always lay back on zombies if the Black Ops 3 sucks and stuff like that. But anyways, if you enjoyed the video, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to see future content, and comment down below like I was saying. Have a good day, and peace.